Hello and welcome to the sixth video in our PV Features series. Today we're going to look at the Player Settings tab and specifically the bespoke bowling lengths and target zones that can be created for each player. To access the settings for each player, first click on their profile by going to Setup in the top left and selecting Player Management. When clicking on the Zones tab here, we open up the Pitch Map settings. The Pitch Maps can be tailored to the exact specifics of each player's bowling style and ability. Every individual length can be user-defined, and you can see here a standard setup would be something like this, where a good length for a seamer is between something like four and seven meters. For a younger player or one of lesser ability, maybe just starting their cricketing journey, you could make the good zone much bigger, encouraging them to bowl fuller length deliveries by changing the measurements in the boxes here. We can also create custom target zones. For example, I might want to test the bowler's ability to hit Yorkers and then a short ball. All of this can be accumulated at the end of the session to see how many times the player has hit the desired zone. I can add in minus figures, which carries the target zone over to the leg side, and I can customize the target to make it as big or as small to match the player's ability. It can be used as a progressive tool, getting smaller and more refined as the player's skill levels increase. Once you have finished setting up your zones, press save. As soon as the player bowls his next delivery, these settings will transfer onto the live pitch map report for instant feedback. Here we can see the target zones and color coding by length on the pitch map. Thanks for listening. As ever, do contact us on info at pitchvision.com with any questions or feedback. Please do share and remember, play, upload and review.